Brian Vinatz here and welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to be doing another story time video for you guys and that is because I finished my first year of secondary school and exactly a year ago I filmed a couple of story times telling you guys about like school so I did one video I remember about leaving primary school and how it was like and then I did a video about how my first day of secondary school went so now a year later obviously I'm going to be showing you guys or telling you guys a little update of how the whole of how the first year has been and obviously since I'm going to be moving into year eight now that means that the primary school kids are going to be leaving their primary school and leaving their friends to go into year seven and start off their new school life so if you are one of those people who are starting secondary school this in September then please like this video and comment down below if you are going to the same school as your friends or are you excited to go to that school or are you a little bit nervous how are you feeling about obviously going and transitioning into secondary school because that is something that some people may struggle with so that's what I'm going to be talking about for you guys today on this video because I feel like you guys like it when I talk about different school struggles and things like that so without further ado let's get straight into the video so obviously if you want to find out how my first day of secondary school went then you can go and watch that video I'll put it in the little i button over here so you can go and click the video and watch it after you finish this video obviously so basically how it is all started is you do the normal lessons obviously but it's also about making friends which is like the main part that people mainly struggle with when they go to secondary school is like oh if you're not going to a secondary school with any of your friends how are you going to make new friends and things like that and I've also done a video before I think about how to make friends at a new school I think I did a YouTube live about this if you haven't seen that I'll put it in that i button over here as well so you guys can go and watch it after this video but I did a couple of videos about school because I know that you guys enjoy watching those videos but the main struggle that people usually go with is making friends at school because first of all you don't know how they're gonna act when they first meet you, you don't know how they're gonna be like when they first meet you. They're like a load of emotions that go through your head on the first day of school. And that was something that happened to me, but if you guys wanna hear like the proper day, how it went, then I'll obviously, as I said before, they can go and watch that video. But I feel like secondary school isn't perfect for everyone because sometimes you have some friends that may, that you might find out that aren't truly your friends or whatever it is. Everybody has their whole entire story of how secondary school works for them. And I've had my little deal, little things that made secondary school for my experience and how it, it creates my experience at home in secondary school but year eight is going to be exciting because it just feels weird saying that you're going to be in year eight because it feels like only yesterday that i was starting off secondary school but i've had the luck of going to a secondary school with with some of my primary school friends and that way i can obviously start off being with them usually i go on the bus with them every single morning and go back home with them every single morning so we're still growing our friendship as well as meeting other new people at secondary school too but also there is a lot a lot of homework and that means you're going to be even more homework in year eight which is absolutely great so if you like homework then you must be very excited for school if you like homework and if you don't like homework comment down below and do the book emoji and a little sad face emoji because that's kind of how i feel like when i do homework but it's okay because i still do my homework and i don't like any detention i mean i've never had a detention before and that's because i'm really really organized as a person and also because my mum tells me about my homework too but I never missed a detention, I never missed a homework before, which means I never had a detention before. But my whole entire first year of secondary school has been pretty good. I mean, I've gotten the good grades that I want. And the main thing about secondary school is just making sure that you are yourself for the whole entire way. And it can be really hard doing that because when you meet different friends, sometimes they make or they might pressure you to feel like someone else or become one of those people. I don't know, maybe it might be putting lots of makeup on or making your hair uh, the way that they use, that they like it or, or acting or having bad behaviour in class or whatever it is or not going to school or bunking school whatever people say or whatever people make you pressure to do what's really hard in secondary school is that you meet so many different people from different classes because obviously your own classes who you meet with in the morning and then when you have different lessons only some of those people who are in your actual class are in maybe your english class or your maths class or whatever it is so you meet a lot of people throughout secondary school like every single day and each of those people have different personalities so 
if someone is pressuring me and someone is not, then it kind of feels a bit overwhelming because you don't know, should I be like this person or should I be like that person? And the real truth is, don't act like any person, you just act like yourself because otherwise, I mean, that's pretty much the only thing that keeps people through secondary school is just being themselves throughout the whole time. People think that they should start doing a certain subject for GCSEs because all of their friends are doing it. But if there's a certain lesson or extra lesson that you have the choice to do and you certainly enjoy that, but maybe your friends might not like it, if you enjoy it, then just go straight ahead and do it. Do whatever what makes you happy and do whatever that makes you look and do whatever you love to do because Otherwise, it's going to be even harder for you to get on with this new subject or get on with whatever your friends might like to do. Just don't feel like you're part of the crowd because why would you want to be fitting in if you were born to stand out? So like, if everybody's doing one certain lesson or if you want to do triple science or something and all your friends want to do double science, if you are passionate about science, then you can go and do that GCSE or do that lesson that you want because that is your choice of doing it. So don't ever feel pressured by other people making you feel like you should do a certain lesson or do something that you might not feel exactly comfortable about because otherwise that makes secondary school pretty miserable and that's why most people may not like high school, may not like secondary school. That's the main thing that people should understand about secondary school. The other thing about secondary school is that it gives you a lot of responsibility because for me, when you have different or when you buy breakfast in the morning or when you buy lunch in the morning, you use your own money so you need to make sure that you have that own responsibility of not spending all your money throughout the whole entire week, whatever it is, because that's your parents' money that you're using or sometimes some parents even make their kids pay for their own lunches or whatever it is. So it gives you a sense of responsibility of doing your homework every single day and making sure you don't get detention, making sure you're not late for school. So it gives you a lot of responsibility. So if you're moving from primary school to secondary school, just be prepared for people to give you quite a lot of responsibility on the first day of school because that is what makes you feel more comfortable day by day when you start getting into secondary school because if they just let you in in the middle of the term telling you guys and giving all this pressure on you guys then that would be very very stressful and for most people some teachers do do that for them unfortunately but for my school they sort of just build up their responsibility and they build up that um i don't know sense of sense of responsibility and sense of organization inside of you every single day which obviously makes you more comfortable with it and makes you used to it obviously but please comment down below your thoughts of secondary school if you already go to secondary school and if you're starting off secondary school then good luck to you i hope that you make loads and loads of friends and i hope that secondary school is really really good for you and just make sure you're always yourself. Make sure that you don't change yourself to be other people's friends or whatever it is. And secondary school is pretty much is pretty much like a whole different world of different people that you get to meet. So make sure you meet lots of people, understand how they are like and their personalities, but never want to turn into their personalities because your personality is absolutely incredible. And I know that every single inspirator here has a different individual, is a different individual, and has a different personality. But you guys are all my inspirators so please like this video if you are excited for summer holidays I was about to say for school and I was about to go what but if you're excited for summer holidays please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to join the inspirators family here on YouTube don't forget to watch the videos that I mentioned in the iPod and I'll see you guys on my next video bye